Jack and Mike here again. Got a nice standard review for you, a little tabletop on uh, a classic, classic AR-15. 16 inch, PSA, PA-15, as y'all can see here. Um, those of y'all looking for an AR right now, uh, y'all know there's a lot on the market. Uh, different, different price points, different budgets, but uh, PSA, PSA has been bringing these PA-15s to the market for a long time now. Uh, it's your standard mil-spec AR, you know. It's got their own upper, their own lower, their furniture, everything about it. Only difference is I put my own optic on this. Besides that, standard Palmetto State PA-15. Yeah, definitely. This is something that, you know, anybody want to get into the AR-15 market. You can go up, when it comes to ARs, and you go from, you know, if you can find them at 500 bucks on special up to two, three, four, five grand. It, it all depends on where your budget is, is what, you know, what type of AR you can get. So, but PSA is a, it's a great entry level gun. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. So, um, like I said, it's classic furniture. Those of you looking for just a standard AR, something to get into the AR world, looking to get into rifles. Maybe it's your first rifle. Um, you're not completely sold on dropping, you know, thousand dollars plus, maybe even eight hundred dollars. There's there's a lot of there's a lot of leeway when it comes to the AR market right now. Um, this honestly is a great option. You've got a 16 inch NATO barrel, one in seven twist, five five six slash two two three. Um, just standard clamshell furniture heat guards inside so it doesn't get too hot uh front sight block all you need is a rear sight and you're good to go just throw on a rear sight irons and that alone could be a pretty decent setup for most people i mean if you're just looking for that do it all rifle you can't beat you can't beat just a yeah, standard 16 inch collapsible adjustable six position mm -hmm everything you got your sling loops ready to go um only only thing different that would come on here is no optic and just a standard a2 grip this is a hogue this is my personal pa15 um it's been great i've ran i've ran a lot of rounds through this thing a lot of rounds and it's been great steel case brass whatever it's 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 it ate it up it. yeah it, it eats it up yeah um like i like i said uh those of you looking for a good do-it-all budget rifle you can't beat palmetto state armory right now um they're america's company right now they're they're doing it all for us yeah most definitely they're hit they're just hitting the market with with all the good stuff that we're looking for different budgets different price points and this is no exception i mean there's there's talk about them you know some of it's good some of it's bad but for the most part i mean from personal experience and from a lot of other people's experience you, you can't go wrong for the for the price i mean for those of you who aren't you know g burning it down five thousand ten thousand rounds you're just looking for something for home defense hunting just yep. to have you know that that you know that prepper rifle that shtf whatever it may be pre just preparedness rifle i mean you can't beat it. What do you think on it? Yeah, yeah, most definitely. You can't beat this uh, AR-15, especially the Palmetto State Armory. It's um, now, you know, of course, if you want to accessorize it, there's there's a, a plethora of accessories, right? I mean, the AR-15. It's, 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 out, it's the Legos, right? It's, yeah. it's the Legos of the of the gun market, right? You could change the grip on it. You could change the stock on it. Uh, the charging handle you can put up whatever you want as a sight you could even change out the gas block out front if you want to put a longer handguard on it muzzle devices suppressors this right here is a, a di direct impingement gun right so the hot gases is what pushes back the bolt um yeah all kinds of magazines out there if you want translucent if you want regular metal mag Fan -ag, you know 60 you're... round 100 round you know it's, it's there's just so much out there for the ar-15 and it's a good way to get into the AR um, market or to, to get into the AR itself, right? Perfect. Um, 
I mean, it's a great jumping off point. Exactly. Anything on this rifle can be either left alone. All you need is a good, good set of sights and you're good to go. Get yourself a couple magazines, a couple boxes of ammo, whatever it may be, and you're, you're set. If you want to upgrade it in the future, absolutely. Absolutely. Furniture, everything on the AR, completely upgradable. It's a good base point. It's a good jumping off point to get into the AR world. Like you were saying, it's it's customizable. It's a, it's the one size fits all for everybody. I mean, it's yeah. America's rifle. This it is, does it all. The recoil on the 223 round, it's especially nothing. on this direct impingement gun, is nothing. A child can shoot it, right? My daughter, she shoots it. Uh, you know, my my kids shoot it it's it's there's if you're if you don't know anything about the ar-15 and all you hear is oh it's uh you know it's a hard recoiling or whatever it's, the, case it's the big be. scary big scary black gun or whatever yeah. ad it's just so, not true it's not true you, you, this is a, a very soft recoiling rifle uh caliber just the ar platform is so uh, you can't go wrong with the ar-15 it's definitely not as heavy Right, it's super light uh, in this in in the in standard config configuration. Yeah, standard configuration. Yeah. Right. The absolutely. more you add on, of course, you know, ounces equal pounds. So, uh, the more you add on to it, the uh, heavier it gets. But as it sits, you take this to the range. Uh, uh, like Jack was saying, home defense, hunting, whatever it is that you want to do with this thing, you could do it, and uh, you can't go wrong. Absolutely not. A little something for the for the whole family, the wife, the kids, whatever. You know, if you're teaching your kids good safety precautions, monitoring them, um, you know, it's it's a it's a family affair. You know, mm -hmm. uh, the AR platform, very very easy controls, very simple to use, very modular. Uh, everything is within reach of the hand. You got your magazine release here, safety on this side, easily accessible mm -hmm. for any size hands. Just swap out the grips, swap out the stock, whatever you want, and it fits everybody. Good dust cover, as as I'm sure most of y'all know, and if you don't, the AR platform is extremely reliable. It it as as long as you do your part, do good maintenance cycles, this thing yeah. it won't let you down. You'll be fine. Yeah. yeah, you could always get into these entry level AR-15s, and and you might have a little bit extra when it comes to your budget, but instead of spending it all on one gun right spend it on this gun then spend some money on some ammo some extra mags a red dot you know a sling on there that's that's pretty much it that way you can take it out to the range yeah. shoot it get used to it right you want to be able to practice with what you have with what you have that way if god forbid you ever need to use it in anything other than hunting or whatever tar target practice you're proficient yeah you, you know what's going on you know you know how to use it you don't uh you know forget what the mag release is or who knows right whatever and that's what makes this this rifle specifically so good uh for just the household in general like i said the wife the kids god forbid something happens again recoil no problem um muzzle flash again volume yeah these are all things that can be fixed and handled with different different uh aftermarket options your suppressors what have you mm -hmm. um as y'all know wtp arms we're a one-stop nfa shop so for those of you wanting to get into the suppressor market y'all want a full you know just let's say you want to just do a budget kit and you have a little bit left over for optics, magazines, give us a call, give us a shout, text. We'll, we'll get you hooked up. Um, if you see something you like, whether you wanna do a whole package deal, you want the rifle, you want an optic, you, you're in this price range that we can we can hook y'all up. We'll, we'll get it, we'll put it in the shop, we'll get everything attached for you. Um, same goes for suppressors as the, the process is just different with suppressors and nfa items but it is an indispensable item for a rifle yeah especially uh, when shooting it inside of a house because absolutely it's super loud right it's it's incredibly loud it's a gunshot right yeah. so putting the suppressor on there will definitely muffle that sound uh enough to concussion, wear concussion <laughs> muzzle flat exactly to where 
you know, you fire around indoors or something. Next thing you, know, you got to drop the gun and cover your ears because they're ringing, right? So, you, you know, you put a muzzle, uh, a suppressor on there, but definitely you deaden the sound. And like I said, you know, your budget is X much, it's X amount, but you don't have to go and spend everything, blow your wad on the rifle. You can buy a cheaper rifle and then buy a suppressor for it. And as you go forward, start swapping out and upgrading more important things, your bolt carrier, whatever. Like, like, like my uh, partner here said, it's, it's the Legos. It's the Legos of the gun world. Everything can be upgraded later. Exactly. Get the base rifle, get yourself set up, red dot sights, couple of magazines, get proficient. Get some ammo. Get some ammo. And from there, you know, you, maybe you want a can, maybe you want a can at the beginning. That's, that's no problem. Personally, I think that's, that's, uh, a, should be a standard. Yeah. It's hard because of the laws and the process. It's tedious, but the WTP arm shop, we make it easy. Oh, One we make stop. it super easy. Everything's done in house yeah, it, right there. On it's the not as difficult as you might think it is. Right? Absolutely. And well, it is, but it's not if you go to the right people, right? So if you come to us, we're going to make it easy, right? We're going to make it as easy as possible for you. One of the few shops in San Antonio, one that's stop, one yeah. stop. One stop. We'll get it all done on the spot. Exactly. And right now, uh, Form 4s are being approved. As long as your background check is, you know, pretty squeaky clean, your background's pretty clean. And what we're, I'm hearing about a couple of days, 48 oh, yeah. hours. Oh, yeah to get your suppressor form four approved, right? Your form four is just if you're buying an NFA item. So, especially on a suppressor, they're, they're taking, uh, they you, what used to take eight, eight, uh, eight months, six months up to a year, right now it's taking 48 hours. So, yeah. hey, take, definitely take advantage of that, so. Absolutely, absolutely. All right, well, uh, we're gonna go ahead and put some B-roll footage throughout the video. Uh, we appreciate you stopping by. Questions, comments, concerns, put them in the comment section below, we'll get to it. Check out WTP Arms. All the links will be in, des in the description. And give us a call. Give us a text. We'll uh, we'll work with any budget. Work with any anything you can think of. Guns, gear, we got it. Um, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, thank you guys. And again, please like, please subscribe, follow us on all uh, social media. To stay up to date with what we get, what we have, and uh, really do appreciate it. See you on the next one.